All right, welcome back everyone. It's so high here. And in this video, we're back with another Borderlands 3 unique gear guide. And this will be showing you guys how to get the unique grenade mod, Doc Henna's Miracle Bomb, which is a unique grenade mod exclusive to the Bounty of Blood DLC. Red text says, give me fever. Uh, damage is 24,830. Radius is 610. Exploder, Miracle Bomb. This one does fire damage. All of these will deal, deal fire damage from what I can tell based on the quest and you actually seen it in action during the quest. This will always do fire damage and what the fire and what the grenade does as you'll see in just a minute. Now in order to get this grenade mod, you're going to want to fast travel right here where I am on the map. We'll fast travel to the blast planes and then come to where I'm at on the map. We're going to be picking up a quest called Miracle Elixir Fixer. Talk to this guy right here, accept the quest, and do the quest. And it's a it's a little bit of a it's not really that long. It took it takes about maybe 10 to 15 minutes to do this quest. It's a little bit longer than normal. But uh just do that quest. You just have to go take out this like factory and stuff. Once you do that, come back, talk to the wife here, and you will turn in the quest once you've done everything. And you will get the grenade mod right there as you can see underneath the map it popped up go into my inventory here and you will see the grenade mod the doc henna's miracle bomb now since the grenade mods actually scale to your mayhem level now grenade mods are actually really useful and they actually do damage and this one it does really good damage now a lot of time during this gameplay i down myself uh with the grenade mod sometimes i stand a little bit too close but uh, as you can see here on flesh enemies, what it does, it deals fire damage. You throw it, it has like the initial damage, and then it creates like this pool of like fire that when they stand in it, it keeps dealing more and more damage. This grenade mod shreds. It does a lot of damage. Even against shielded targets, it does pretty good damage for fire. Uh, this grenade mod's really good. I'm really liking that they finally made grenade mods actually pretty viable again. Uh, I haven't really used a grenade mod for like pure damage since the porcelain pipe bomb back when the game first came out when that thing was like the most overpowered thing in the game. That's really the last grenade mod that I remember that did like really, really, really good damage. And this one's doing really good damage. I I'm really liking this grenade mod. It's one of the best ones that I've found so far, definitely. And I want to, I haven't. Then again, I haven't really tested out a lot of the other grenade mods since the update actually scaled there. Actually, I died there. Someone shot me on that one. That wasn't the grenade mod. That wasn't my fault on that one. But yeah, I was genuinely surprised. This great grenade mod actually surprised me. I, I kind of forgot there for a minute that they actually scaled them up to Mayhem 10. So when I first started using this, uh, it actually kind of surprised me. But this grenade mod does really good damage, especially against those flesh targets because... Uh, this obviously this weapon deals fire damage you go up against those flesh targets and they're standing in that pit of fire while burning It's gonna do massive damage So yeah, that's all I have in this video guys uh, feel free to leave a like comment and subscribe if you guys enjoyed it and uh, Like I said definitely recommend you go out and pick up this grenade mod. It's a really good one uh, I definitely think you should use it whenever, uh, whenever you get a chance. Go pick it up. Uh, probably farm and get like a better anointment than the one I had on mine. Mine is just action skill start regenerate one grenade. Uh, I meant to farm it, but I kind of forgot to do it. And it's really hard to farm on Xbox because the loading screens are so long. And you'd have to dashboard farm. But yeah, like I said, leave a like, comment, subscribe if you guys enjoyed it. And I'll, I'll see you guys on the next one.